Now Liu Kang. Knocks Shazam down to the floor and then he dives on him. Oh, he missed. He moved. And now he's going to this turn to dive on him and he's successful. That blood, sweat, and tears. Shazam will put the title on the line against Thor. But Liu Kang could win the Money in the Bank ladder match and cash in. We could see this match at Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Again, no one's ever cashed in a Money in the Bank on the same night of winning. It's never happened. Could happen at Blood, Sweat, and Tears 9, though. That was like an angular slam right there. With a knee right in the head right there. Bye. Marvel, and there's a bulldog by Liu Kang, and now Liu Kang's coming back. Both feet right in the face. Could be thinking split Kang drop. Got it. And he gets a pin on the SC to be a champion just days before blood, sweat, and tears. That would be huge. Now what's he doing? Oh my, oh, that didn't work. Uh, ooh, that looked bad. I'm not sure what he was going for there. It didn't work. I sent him into the guardrail. But back comes Liu Kang. And oh, he missed. He missed big time. Well, he didn't miss there, though. Now when he's down up on the apron, and, whoa, look at that. Look at it. You saw it. He's going to the top rope. What's he going to dive from out there? This is not a good idea, Liu Kang. No! Oh, my goodness. I don't even know if that was still a good idea, but he did. at least he connected with Shazam there. Kang now in control in this match, it would seem. Reverse twist of fate! And uh, that was a mistake. And now Marvel to the top, and oh, he went for like a splash on his back, and no. Now Liu Kang up top again. With the one foot right in the face there. And gets a two count. A near fall. This Liu Kang continues to pour on the offense. And. Has Shazam been busted open? Has he busted the champ open? Oh! Oh my goodness! What a super kick! Was it busted or he kicked out? Well, if he wasn't busted open before that, he's busted open now, and that was mistakey. Or where it was. Another foot to the face! And, but Shazam takes it now, chop block! Yeah, Irish whip. Into a power slam! And now Shazam to the top. What do we call this now? Look at knees and the he missed it. It was blocked. Look at oh, here we go. Two. Oh, just two. There's a knee right to the gut. And more kicks. And that Shazam has been busted open. And he's got Irish whip him to the outside. But uh oh, here we go. Oh what a, they dropped him with that Shades of Randy Orton. That more Randy Orton, that backbreaker. 
We see him do that too. Look at his Orton's moveset. Oh! What a DDT that was! And I think that busted him open! And now all the thunder struck, and that's gonna be it! Or maybe not. He's gonna pose. Oh, look at this. Liu Kang is up! And Liu Kang is down. He'll sit all hard into the corner there. Oh, wait, that punch is blocked! Oh, he got the Kang kick! He got the Kang kick! Oh, but he rolled out of the ring. And he got dove on! You know, thought it might have been over. He hit the can kick. It, but somehow he counters with that, that move. He rolls him back into the ring. Tells him to get up. We can knock him down. He's got Kang up and... Wait, what's this? The thud... Oh, no! Oh! Electric chair driver! My God! Electric chair driver in the Shazamosity! I don't know what else to call it. It's a three! And Shazam is your winner! And he was glorious! Even though he got busted open. Shazam has defeated Liu Kang, heading into blood, sweat, tears. Let's take a look at the end here. You knew it was over when he hit this. The ele electric chair driver. That put down Liu Kang. In a moment, I think we're going to re-look at it. Celebrating. Here's a replay. Oh! I forgot to put replay. And then the Shazamosity. Gets the three. Oh, wait! Look at this! Look who's here! And has he? Yes, he has! He's brought his friend with him! And. Oh, Jazam is not happy. Well, Shazam needs the hammer. Oh, he put the hammer down and he goes into the ring. And, well, we tried to hit him with the belts. And that didn't work. And he doesn't need the belts, either! And he just backdropped him! And now... Oh, Thor! Thor is going for Mjolnir and Cow! He dropped it on his head! And, and now he's running away! With the title belt, he won't be able to run at blood, sweat, and tears! In the main event, the HCW Championship on the line. God versus Demigod. For the most prestigious prize in all of CAW. Who's leaving St. Louis as SCAW Champion?
Hellboy and Edward Elric. And they will be a team in just moments. Our main event is coming up. And blood, sweat, and tears is coming. We're not that far from it now. And what a card it's going to be. The SCW Women's Championship on the line. Will Chun Li win the title for the first time? She's got a tall mountain to climb. All right, we're the greatest female performer in SCW's history, Lara Croft. The SCW Tag Team Championship, the stakes are high. The champs think the challengers have no chance. And if King loses, we'll probably never see him again or Kenshin ever again. And two, perhaps two of the greatest fighters against two of the greatest performers. Avril Lafine and Amy Lee team up to take on Shampoo and Ukyo. The Money in the Bank ladder match. Six superstars. Who will grab the ladder? Get a guaranteed title match. Mercedes, the Nangri Video Game Nerd, Luke Kang, Gladiator, Yusuke, or Erlacher. The SCW Legends Championship. A six-pack elimination challenge. Can Ryu survive? You've got three former SCW champions in there. Two former No DQ World Champions. A tall order for the Legends Champion. SCW Internet Championship and the SCW Zero One Championship. Winner will have both belts. Will Snake become a double champion? Will Jim Kazuma do it? Who will make history as being the first ever to hold both titles at the same time? And how about a six-man war? Team Guile versus Team Superman. And this match will be a six-man elimination tag team match at Blood, Sweat, and Tears. And ladies and gentlemen, the Civil War will be anything but civil when former friends Former allies, now enemies, Captain America and Iron Man. It's going to be explosive. And the streak, yes. Hellboy's never been beaten in blood, sweat, and tears. Albert Wesker has vowed to be the one to become a god by defeating Hellboy. But will it happen? And the Joker will face Spider-Man. Fredman has shown him in the black suit, but are we going to see that? What are we going to see? That blood sweat and tears when these two fight. What we saw here tonight was bizarre. What happened to blood sweat and tears will be more bizarre. No doubt about it. And hell in a cell. Edward Elric versus Robin look to settle the score. And standing in the middle is the special referee, the Green Lantern. I don't know what's going to happen to that guy. And the main event, the SCAW Championship, the most prestigious prize in all of CAW, Thor and Shazam, God versus Demigod, it's blood, sweat, and tears. It's shaping up to perhaps be our greatest show ever. St. Louis, get ready. There ain't no grave can hold my body down There ain't no grave can hold my body down When I hear that trumpet sound I'm gonna rise right out of the ground Ain't no grave can hold my body down And we're inching closer and closer now. And a huge main event. Huge tag team match. To match the two men who headlined Blood Sweat Tears 8 are teaming up. I think you'd see that. Yeah, we see it time to time. How many times have we seen people main eventing WrestleMania team? Six days before Blood Sweat before WrestleMania 17, Stone Cold The Rock were tag team partners. Hell, WrestleMania 23, we saw the pay-per-view before the two world title matches. Never part. And they had a rematch on Raw six days before WrestleMania. Okay. 
Let's talk about this. Hellboy. Ne since he debuted at Blood, Sweat, and Tears 2, never lost the event. But could he lose for the first time in it? Come Blood, Sweat, and Tears 9. He's 7 0. Including the win last year over Edward Elric. And Edward Elric, that was the first time he was ever beaten at Blood, Sweat, and Tears. And he's had historic success at the event as well. His first Blood, Sweat, and Tears was Blood, Sweat, and Tears 4. In an elimination tag match involving Captain America, Ghost Rider, Guile, he pinned all three men that night in Toronto. And it's continued on. Blood, Sweat, and Tears 5, he defeated Ichigo Kurosaki, another former SCW champ. Blood, Sweat, and Tears 7. He became SCAW champion, defeating the Prince of Persia, ending the old era, and beginning the new era. He spent much of the last year away from SCAW, but he is back, and at Blood, Sweat, and Tears, he will be inside the cell with Robin, where this all began. the SCW Championship. He decided that this was the match he wanted at the biggest show of the year. He passed the chance to compete in this year's SCW Tournament just so he could get this match. Because it was all he wanted. He said anyone could win a title. But no one but him can defeat Hellboy. Will he become a god by defeating him? It's such a big question because we don't know the answer to it. And here comes the boy wonder turned jackass. That is what he's been. Ever since the Green Lantern announced his retirement, he's been on in rage, blaming Edward Elric for it. October of 2015, he dropped Elric through the hell in a cell. That night, saying he blamed him and said he would do to him what he claimed Elric did to Green Lantern. If you go back, you know the story. It doesn't quite play out like that. I don't think Elric had anything to do intentionally ending the Green Lantern's career. It's going to be Hellboy to start this match, though. And let us know it's going to be Robin that tags in. Well, Wesker's going to keep away from Hellboy here. I mean, it might be a smart move. I don't know. I don't want to fight Hellboy. You want to fight Hellboy? Hellboy's going to tag in Edward Elric. This tag team main event. These two men will fight inside the cell at Blood, Sweat, and Tears. And here, you know he's going to tag it. I think he just tagged Wesker in. Yes, he did. Wesker is now the legal man. has a shot at Edward Elric. This huge tag team match will continue as Hellboy stares down. He was distracted momentarily and allowed Elric to take over. Hellboy gonna come on in? Yes, he is! Yeah, here we go! 